you know, as I said, I have like a lot of questions for her. Uh, more particularly, um, th there was a time when uh, we were traveling together and uh, she did speak about Mother and Veer and she's made videos also um, on that uh, sweet little lord, um, you know, and how he has actually transformed lives of people. Do, do you want to like just share a few instances of how people have really benefited because of him and how their lives have transformed? Absolutely. See, in whole of last year, uh, what I observed in 2022, he was the hero. Yeah. And, and he's yeah. always been my hero. But uh, yes. what I see is he's actually giving instant results to my clients and devotees who actually rely on him for uh, his help and blessings. So, uh, some of the things that I can talk about is, I think which I have spoken in my previous video, is to get back the money. See, people oh. often lend money to others with some intention of getting more interest or probably they really genuinely wanted to help somebody and you know, yes. uh, they lent money. And what happens is that they don't return on time and some deny, no, no, you haven't given money. So, they have ideas of cheating and things like that. So, that, those are the kind of people who really got very good help and uh, respite, I can say, from Viran because nice. they got back their money. Oh. <laughs> there are people who did not have agreement signed between uh, two parties, but no documentation to say that, um, you know, they owe each other money, whatever, all of those, even the worst case scenarios have got their money back. So that is one great thing that has happened. Amazing. And uh, people with mental health issues have come out of it. People would wake up with panic attacks and fear and, uh, you know, a lot of depression, depressing thoughts and, you know, suicidal tendencies. Such, such uh, wonderful souls with so much potential are actually being bogged by some some unknown fear. And he's an Ugra Devata, right? He's Correct. A, you should know, like, uh, yeah. by now. So what he's going to do is he instill you with a lot of willpower, confidence, remove the fear element out, cut it out. And, and uh, such people are now actually back to being normal, back to oh, their sense. work, back to exploring life and their true potential. Amazing. A lot of people uh, usually call, uh, call me for Shatrubhata related problems. Like okay. People have enemies and black okay. magic attacks. And believe me, they don't believe in black magic unless until they are affected by it. Yeah. People always wonder, is there a jewelry, is there something called black magic? I don't really believe in that and things right. like that. When they're actually affected, they're like, oh, please help. <laughs> So, sure. you know, this happens till you are affected. So, a lot of cases of black magic attacks where people were victims of black magic, you know, such negative energies were removed. One pregnant lady, um, she was not actually inflicted by black magic, but many spirits feed on uh, pregnant women. So, this pregnant lady would always sense a spirit around her and this spirit was troubling her. But uh, she's quite a daring woman, I must say. So, she was not really bogged by it. She just ignored it. But once what happened was, uh, the spirits know how to deal with this, you know, they try to create fear. Mm -hmm. Fear is their energy. Uh, so, uh, it tried to disturb, the spirit tried to disturb the child. That is when the mother gets disturbed. Correct. See, when the mother is seeing the spirit, mother is actually not bothered. This lady in particular, I'm saying. Uh, but the moment the child saw and freaked, she was panicking. She just called, she said, I don't know what to do. And mother, we went Bibuti and we gave a thread. Work wonders, it just disappeared, and that day onwards, still now they have not seen the spirit or sighted the spirit, it has not troubled. She's delivered a child, and they're all fine. Oh, yeah, that's that's another thing that has happened. And people who wanted to do business with targets in mind uh, also said, You know, Veera, you do this for us, and we will do this for you in return. Such people have met their targets. Right. Yeah, amazing, amazing. It's like uh, there is no area or boundary where Viran does not function. Land disputes, Kritika, so many disputes where there are litigation problems, inheritance, family inheritance issues. People are not ready to sign and just because they are not ready to sign, you, you can't get your claim. And which would rightfully belong to you, uh, there Viran has helped. Oh. So the list is actually endless, but I will definitely do a short on just that yeah. on uh, the top, will, top six help. or ten miracles that we have <laughs> performed. Yes, <laughs> yes. The, truly, as you said, he's a hero. Yeah, a sale of land. I mean, the list is really endless. People have had health issues of prayer, and it has really helped. Amazing. Yeah. <laughs>
Okay, wait. So now, now let's say people with genuine problems. Um, I mean, you know, you 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 would have done their chart, so you you know what it is and how how it is progressing. But what if someone comes to you and says that I want this intent, I, I want this wish to be fulfilled, or I have this intention, and I want to do a puja for Viran and. Uh, I mean, yeah. so if this is the case, will will Viran actually acknowledge all of those or, I mean, even those genuine wish that one has for something or even those, let's say, not so genuine wish that they have for something? Yeah, it does work because uh, what really happens is when you are ready to receive Viran's blessings is when you can come to him. Okay. Trust me, Kritika, so many people I would have mentioned in their reading. When I give a reading, I also give them remedies. Correct. And I do suggest that, you know, this is something that you should do. And uh-huh. they don't do it. Okay. Got it. That means they are not ready yet. Right. If only they are ready, it will happen. Yeah. And uh, one more thing is that unless your request is genuine, now genuinity, everybody is genuine. Okay. You know, everybody sincerely wants something. Correct. But whether it right for, it's good for you or not, is the right time, something we didn't decide. Okay. So one lady, I think she's spoken in one of the testimonials also, she sent oh, a video, okay. it's in Canada, wherein uh, she prayed to get her uh, house sold. Hmm. And uh, we did the Viran Puja and then she had somebody coming over for rent. And she was quite disappointed because the rental income was very low. So she called me and she said, ma'am, I asked for sale and I got somebody for rent. I said, just go for it. Maybe this is what is best for you right now. And then reluctantly she agreed. Hmm. And okay. three months later, the land around which she had the house got developed. And because of some highways and all that. Now the land price has gone up. Oh, and now she understands that if she sells now, she is going to get so much, much more, more than what she was getting earlier. So now she understands why the delay happened. Right. So now she understands it's not a delay. Right. Okay. It's the timing. timing. See, gods definitely, they are all of higher dimension than us and they will understand. They will know. They can see the future. They know our past. They know what's best for us. One thing is that doing the puja in the right way is most important. Correct. Which I am very sure about my team. Yeah. So, my team of priests are excellent. I can vouch for them and I have been doing this for so long. And, uh, you know, if it's worked for uh, most of them, why will it not work for you? If Correct. it's not work for you, it's for a reason. Correct. It is still going on. The process is still on. Right. So, it will happen one it day. It will happen. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that's amazing. Many people also, Pradika, I want to tell you, they think they're right. They need not be right. Okay. In the eyes of law or justice. Oh, in so, the sense they say that... They, ah, they just feel, uh, no, no, this actually belongs to me and I'm okay. not getting it. No, no, this is how it's supposed to be. I know it's correct. That's right. not about what you know or I know. It's in the mm-hmm. eyes of God. Right. And if you ask for something which is very adharmic and bec- only because you think mm-hmm. you rightfully deserve it, uh, we may not agree. He's he is instant actually. You know, uh, once what happened, one of my clients requested for a video of a Viran Puja. Okay. And, uh, you know, we usually send only the RT and certain mm-hmm. things because he's Ugra Devata, he will not like it. Exactly. But this particular client of mine insisted a lot and we agreed. Mm-hmm. I said, okay, I'll talk to him at the temple. And the temple priest tried to take the picture and the video. The phone. Uh, probably this is the height where we, this was the pedestal where we were inside was and he was there. You know, even if I drop my phone down, it will not shatter into pieces. But his phone shattered into pieces. Like, Viran is so expressive. He will just, if he doesn't like something being uh, done or shot, he will just, uh, he will just tell you in as many uh, instances and, you know, evidently show you that it is not what you are supposed to. And, and literally his 10,000 or 12,000 rupees phone just got uh, shattered into pieces and then no photos, no videos. That's oh. it. One other instance wo- that happened was this uh, devotee who made a vow and offered a particular dhan to the temple. Once his vow was fulfilled. Now, after some time, he changed his mind. Oh. And he said, no, no, I'll take back what I've given and I'll give something else instead. So, he took back whatever offering he offered, he sold it and he, he donated a drum uh, uh, like you know the the bells, the electric mm-hmm. uh, bell and the mm-hmm. drum, everything together. So that is something that he t- donated back to the same temple. But in the process, the whatever he had sold, he made some money mm-hmm. for himself. Okay. Mm-hmm. Now the day that was installed, the whole thing got burnt. The the entire motherboard of that uh, mm-hmm. uh, the drum and that instrument, I don't know what it's called, but that entire thing got burnt. Mm-hmm. And uh, not a single day it has been used. He will not accept it. 
correct so you know you can't play the fool see like yeah. shiva with vishnu they're very high dimension gods so sometimes even if you err uh, you know by yeah. the time you see the response maybe there's a time gap or delay so you don't really connect and say oh maybe because i did this this happened right. but with veer and with patadarsya ma with the, uh, the grama devatas or the lower dimension gods mm-hmm. it's not like that instantly they'll show you when i went uh, when i visited the temple near kumbakonam Uh, the temple priest was saying, "See, Agar, this is how they uh, give it back, and they do trading with God, and the same yeah. like he just burnt it. So it's like the switchboard, everything is gone. Oh, <laughs> mm. yeah. So much more to this. You're playing with fire. If you know how to use the fire, you can cook, <laughs> and you can keep yourself warm. So many things you can do. And if you don't know how to, you get burnt. Correct. Simple as that. Correct. <laughs>